damn, 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 damn right I'm somebody. I dedicate this epic adventure to my man Kenny Rob. Now I can never ever get Kenny to go fishing with me, but he's always encouraged me to travel the world and do all my bucket list things so he can live vicariously through me. Rest in peace, King. Good morning, beautiful people. I get back to you about an hour or something when I wake up. I'm on our way to catch a monster. Famous Captain Matt but himself. <laughs> Go ahead, brother. Time to get it, fellas. Please listen to me. If the captain suggests that you sit in the back of the boat because it's a smoother ride and you have less chance of getting seasick, please listen to him. He's the damn captain. Right. 
Steve, get it. Size, size of the hooks that we use. Just got the spot number two. The water is a lot calmer over here. I was almost ready to give it up for the people a minute ago on these uh, half pipe weaves. So let's see what's going to happen. Got it? 
this thing down. Goodbye, big boy. Yeah, he's a monster. about that experience, bro. Number one rating, bro. Hey, Armstrong. That's the first time in my life I've ever seen you about to tap out, bro. Bro, that was, if you ran one more time, I think I'd have had to tap. <laughs> and we even got a little lunch for the, for the day. Captain Matt doing his thing. The fish got through. Uh -oh. Gotta do the test on the fish. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's fine. Cool, appreciate it. Yes, the fish are making it back. You are making a connection in Philadelphia. You will find a diagram of the Philadelphia airport in the back of the American Way magazine. What's up, beautiful people? Made it back in one piece, and I must say that was one of the craziest trips I've ever been on in my life. Um, I just want to go over a few things. A lot of people ask, how did I even come up with the trip? First of all, I'm a nerd, so I watch a lot of National Geographic, and that's when I first found out about the Goliath Grouper. But then I saw this crazy dude on the internet catching one with a turkey. Oh. Shout out to you, sir. Because after watching your video, I said, I gotta do this shit. The Goliath grouper is a protected, critically endangered species. You're allowed to catch them and release them unharmed or they will lock your ass up. Drink tons and tons and tons of water and always use some type of motion sickness medicine. Me personally, I always use Dramamine. Invest in some real glasses. You know, the, 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 the ugly ones, the ones that look like the Terminator that really has like the UV ray protection and stuff. Don't be a dummy like me and get some designer glasses. They don't work. You're going to be blind by the time the damn trip is over. Make sure you wear plenty of sunscreen. There is no shade and there is no air condition in the middle of the ocean. Sunscreen is very important. My brother was born and raised in Florida. He said he's part Cherokee Indian and he doesn't sunburn. The next day he looked like a piece of turkey bacon. Ladies and gents, if you are too pretty to sweat or to strain so hard that you actually pass gas this is not the trip for you thanks for watching and stay tuned for other epic adventures smash that like button and we'll see you all next time goodbye